So I just passed the toll booth. Um, it says cash or e-pass. And I actually didn't have cash. Luckily I had change. And the guy was really friendly and let me sit there and count change um, to four dollars. So, uh, Heather, thanks for the heads up that there would be, even Krista, that there would be a pass that takes money. Hi. So I'm in Nova Scotia. It is rain, rain, wet, rain, and, um, and the S word, snow. It's, what day is it? It's October 31st, happy Halloween. Uh, I'm here, I was gonna go to a soccer game um, in somewhere. And uh, it's too cold, I'm not feeling well. And I'm gonna stay and hand out some cheesies. Humpty Dumpty cheese sticks and some Pepsi if anyone comes by. Um, today I discovered that I have another pet peeve. Um, actually, I already know I had this pet peeve. This is just an angered pet peeve. Uh, when people purposely write checks when they know that there is not enough money in their account. And it's usually the people that you uh, have helped a lot and basically given more than you should and uh, in return they thank you by screwing with your bank account. Not impressed. Uh, anyway, life goes on. I will figure it out and uh, to all those people out there who think that that's cool, just be honest. Say you don't have the money instead of writing a check and signing it with your name and having it not go through. Uh, let's see, other than that, it's my one month anniversary. I've officially gone over the one month mark. I am in Nova Scotia, the end of my trails in Canada. Um, within this week, I will be heading to the United States and stopping in Maine. I'm writing up a financial itinerary to get to Florida and hopefully hopefully find some uh, under the table help slash donation to the cause work. I'll air this once I'm in the States because they may watch it and not let me in. Anyway, I'm looking forward to the sunshine and some drier weather, even though I'm pretty sure it's still humid down there, but um, I may be going to Atlanta, Georgia, someplace I've kind of always wanted to see, more so just for the accent, so I'm hoping they do have an accent there. I'm uh, also putting a shout out to anyone who may know Gladys in Austin, Texas. Love to hang out with you and have a drink. Ooh. Autofocus gone bad. Hello. Looking for Gladys in Austin, Texas. Um, I'm not much of a drinker, but I'm sure I could have a glass with her. And, uh, yeah. I'm gonna veg today. Write in my not for public exposure journal. <laughs> and, um, yes, very interesting so far. Very interesting. A lot of political issues which I knew would come up have come up. Uh, again, I am not sharing those on my blog until I'm officially finished and completed my tour. And then I will share everything. Unless people really want to know what's going on, but I'm pretty sure we all know what's going on. I just want to make sure that I can get all sides of the story to figure out 
if kindness is innate, if kindness is what we are, or if it's taught, or if just overall goodness, for lack of a better word right now, is, is just in us, our change due to society, due to circumstances, due to how we're raised, nurture nature. Um, I, for one, believe we are innately kind. We are a species that is and will take care of each other, should take care of each other, but for some reason the animals got it figured out, we don't. One day. How are you? Good. That's good. <laughs>